We are at the halfway point of the January transfer window and I tell you what guys, what is going on at Rangers Football Club because there's nothing coming in. It's honestly soul destroying. I'm seeing jokes this morning on Twitter that people would take Lee Griffiths and the uh, past few days on Twitter have been pretty explosive for uh, Gru, so to speak. But that, that's probably been the, 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 the biggest thing that's happened in this transfer window. Now if you're not on Twitter, you're probably going, well, hmm, what's the hell, what are you on about? I can't be getting arsed into it, right? See Twitter these days. It's just full of, like, faceless accounts that, you know, troll each other. And with Elon Musk taking over, it's got that. It's either that or people like, oh, oh, who's got this leaked fed? This OnlyFans that. OnlyFans this. Twitter is a fucking cesspool, man. Right? It really is. It's an absolute fucking disaster. I, I, I only use it to get news. But you have to scroll through so much to get news, right? But anyway, let's talk about the news. We're Rangers Football Club at the minute. And um, <laughs> there's not an awful lot, of course. Yelmas bid rejected yesterday. And uh, we have been linked with Gigi Small. But let's talk about a different left back that we've been linked with. And Rangers linked left back David Juracek could leave Bayern Munich on Bayern Munich, Benfica on loan this month in search of regular football, but the 23-year-old has options other than the Ibrox club he would prefer to explore at this point. Now, that is according to Football Scotland. I mean, how much is really in this, to say the least? I mean, Clement wants January recruits like we all do, but at the end of the day, what about this guy? I mean, I think this deal's only really going to happen if Yilmaz leaves, which, of course, Rangers went ahead and rejected it yesterday, right? But for me, I just don't really get what's going to happen here because a Rangers, I don't know what the end game is, a Rangers waiting for a, a higher bid, then they're going to accept it. Because the, the, the Dodge rumours and the, did you, I mean, even though there's nothing in the Dodge rumours, like we've heard today that it looks like Marseille are completely pulling at the deal because they're getting dicked around by Hellas Verona. So what, what, what's going on? Um, you know, the, the rumours to Marco Bulla are high as well but I mean he's going to cost like 5 million it's like well he's not even a striker I mean if we're going to spend 5 million just sign Shankland or some other striker that's going to bang in the I mean I, I'm sick I'm actually sick of talking about Lauren Shankland I want him in right we know if we sign Lauren Shankland we are getting obviously right halfway through the season we are getting upwards of 10 goals at least right probably 15 closer to 20 Last season, he was the first Hearts player to get over 20 goals in a season since 1992 when Big John Robertson did that, right? We, it will be the easiest repaid millions that we, are get, we will get, right? Even if Shankland doesn't surpass what he's done at Hearts, it will still be a great signing for the simple fact is he will be getting goals. And I'm not talking about what Hearts have won fuck all and he's only bringing goals. No, no, no. I'm talking about the goals he'll, he'll automatically bring. You know, he's, he's, he's captain of hearts, he'll bring those leadership qualities, we'll have a, a leader filler up the pitch rather than a headless chicken like Dessers who runs about like in slow motion, man. Not, we've not just ripped the head off the chicken, we've ripped the legs off him. Um, we'll have a leader up the top end of the pitch, we'll have a goal scorer up the top end of the pitch, and overall, we'll, we'll just be better. I don't understand what the fuck we're waiting on, Rangers. We're halfway through the month, I'm fuming, I couldn't give a fuck about bringing in a left back for Benfica, bringing in a left back for 20. I want the 28-year-old Lauren Shanklin, baby. I want the guy in. I want him now. And I I'm sick of it. Rangers. You know what I'd see instead of this pussy footing around? Who's Mr. Mabas? All right, Tony Soprano, if you get that reference, season four, episode two, um, no show. Anyway, um, point is, this needs to happen. See, instead of Rangers just, like, you know, letting the rumour simmer out there, like it's on a slow cooker, come out and stick it in the microwave if you want them. Right? And if you don't want them, unplug the slow cooker and fuck it in the black bin. Because honestly, I do not want to sit here for the next two weeks talking about Lauren Shanklin this, Lauren Shanklin that. I just want Lauren Shanklin then or denied right now. See the way they quickly come out and distance themselves with Batch Y? I want that to happen or else you sign them. Sort it out, Rangers. You're pissing me off. Back to David Urasek. Of course, he's 23. He's only made 11 appearances this season. And he could be seeking a loan move. To ensure he gets a few more worth of games, months or games under his belt. Football Scotland understands the players' other options he'd prefer to explore at this point, but that could change. So, you know, sounds like we're his like, third option or something. Whoop they do. That's brilliant, isn't it? That's fab dabby dozy at the end of the day. But come on, Rangers, man. I, I, I am, we are starving here. We are absolutely 
starving. We need a signing and we need it. No.